There we go. Now you should be able to hear me. I was like, something is missing. <laughs> there we go. Some, some color. And let me put the... Why did I put this on? Hello? Why can I not hear anything? Okay. Could you hear the music before? I don't know if you could. Anyways, I'm just holding on to a breath. Because <laughs> I just realized that I'm super hungry. I've been editing a couple of hours. Or an hour and a half. And I just finished editing and I was about to go live and I'm like, oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> so I have a piece of flatbread. Mm. Hi. Sorry. I shouldn't be eating on stream. I do this every time. <laughs> Hi, Ada, to Ada. Ada Tokaboka. Just a fun name. Mm. How are you? I hope you're well. Welcome to the stream. Hi, Besky. And... Bird! Hi, Bird! How are you doing today? The sound is okay? Good. I am a little bright. I don't know how... How to fix that. It's because of this. Like, if I were to take this off if I put this on look it's the contrast of my shirt this is what usually happens also by the way I am wearing a shirt I'm just not like flashing you guys <laughs> maybe I can like have the collar like or maybe I should just change the shirt I don't know Mm. Potato bread! It is potato bread. However, it's not made of potato. It's the same concept, but instead of um, potato, it's made from oat. It does look a little bit like a waffle. It's like a circular little flat bread. It's quite soft. It's really good. Hi, Penny. Oh, hi! <laughs> I recognize you. I just watched the... Oh my god, if any one of you... Well, you probably are Sims fans because <laughs> you're watching a Sims stream. Go watch Penny... Penny... Penny Elm? Penny Elm? Sorry, I don't know how to say your name. Um, go watch her new uh, video, like a machinima first episode came out... I don't know when I saw your comments on my series. Yes, it's awesome. I loved it. It's so good. I'm so hyped for the next episode. So she, sorry, I just assumed she. Please let me know your pronouns. But they are, um, you can call me Penny. Okay, good. I thought so, but I, I wasn't sure. And I, I don't want to make assumptions, even though I do sometimes. <laughs> Anyways, um, they just like recently posted a first episode for a machinima series, which is like a murder mystery, high school or college, like a school type of thing. Uh, Serendipitia, I always forget how to say their name as well. Tia from Serendipitia, <laughs> sorry. Um, she also, uh, is, like, somehow in, like, pronouns are she, her, okay, good to know, thank you. Mm, they're making a collaboration together with the series, and, uh, she told me that it's gonna be, like, a kind of inspired by the, the Good Girl's Guide to Murder, which is a book, what I, which I have written not written <laughs> read <laughs> i wish i had written it no 
Um, I have read it and it's such a good book. I'm so hyped for this series. I'm so... College murder mystery. There we go. Perfect. Somebody with actual words. There we go. Um, I'm so hyped for it. So if you like kind of storytelling aspects and machinimas and kind of anything like that, go watch um, something... Hold on, let me just see i forgot the name something view i forgot it already like a cottage cheese brain that i have <laughs> penny you can help me out if you if you um if you want <laughs> hi i was just talking about you tia i was just talking about you tia Be baby thank you Yes, Bayview. I was. I love that I'm just holding a piece of bread, like all throughout this, and I'm also getting warm. So I think I'm gonna take off the the jumper, and we will be blessed with no more super bright light too. <laughs> oh, okay. There we go. Now I look like I'm naked. Love that. <laughs> um, yes, I was just raving of on um, Bayview because I'm so excited. It's such a good first episode. I'm super hyped, and I wanna I wanna see more. And I wanna like tell you guys if you have not yet watched that, go watch it and give Penny a little follow because. It's awesome what you do. Honestly, it's it's so good. I have only made one machinima and that is, well, one and a half. And that wasn't even, like, spoken. Like, there was no, like, dial dialogue or anything. Um, so, yeah. I know how hard it is. Or, like, I know how hard it can be. Because it was so hard. <laughs> and I'm not even, like good at it <laughs> okay mm, let's see I think I missed some messages um happy Saturday to you too uh, I used I was supposed to have work today but then I went into work and we were too many like too many of us were on the shift so they decided that some of us could go home so I went home <laughs> Which is good. <laughs> well, not good for money, but good for me. Because then I I got some time to myself and editing and stuff like that. Which is nice. Um, oh, I thought it's because of the ring. No, the ring light is really good. It's just that I don't have a good camera. I just have a webcam. And the webcam doesn't really have a good color lens. Like, it, it doesn't really understand color very well. And uh, the contrast is kind of all over the place. So I should always wear something light on streams. Because otherwise if I wear something dark, the contrast will be really a lot. And I will like be burnt. Like burnt out in the lighting terms. <laughs> Not burnt out as in like too tired. Mm. I just came home from dancing. So physically very tired. I'm proud though because i got a compliment about my facial expressions etc during the dance because it's something well that's really good facial expressions are hard when you're dancing because obviously you're so focused on like what you're doing your with your hands and legs and all the choreo that it's really hard to remember to also express it in your face so that's actually really good. That's really, really good. But I, I had no doubts because I think you're a really good dancer. Mm, I'm super insecure about and I've been working on it so much in Just Dance. But that's paying off. That's really, really good. Um, yes. S besides Sims, I'm also just my best friend's fan. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Okay, imagine you'd be my my nemesis. Or what's a hater? You'd be my number one hater. <laughs> what about that? Mm. 
Yes, I love murder mysteries as well. I'm so hyped for this series. I actually wanted to do a murder mystery, like, interactive video. Not a machinima at all. But this, like, kind of murder mystery, like, not a let's play either. Like, a, a series where, like, viewers can, like, kind of take their votes into... A, I, I'll take their votes into account and, like reveal stuff for the viewers so the viewers can also like impact the the gameplay i really wanted to do that but it it i don't really know how to go about it it's a tough job i don't quite know how to like implement that into the sims because i don't have a very active following i don't usually get comments on my videos and i don't usually like inter interact with people too much uh, I would obviously love to, but not many people on YouTube comment. Uh, so it's a bit hard if I did something like that and then nobody would comment on it. Which which would then defeat the purpose of me doing it like an interactive way. <laughs> mm, there, there is a peep, there's a person who played Murder Mysteries game as a character on Twitch. Roleplay, murder investigation. Yes, this is... Uh, a, a lot of people do something like that, which is cool. <laughs> it's nice to see you here, Tia. I hope you're doing okay. I hope you're doing great. Um, we're gonna be playing Not So Berry. <laughs> yes, I love Not So Berry as well. I've been super, like, excited to get back to it, but it's just been too... Um, too much with my job currently that I hadn't been able to um, really get into streaming again. But now I'm here. So let's hopefully actually finish today's... Not today's. Finish uh, current air. Because we're on the verge of getting the baking skill. Which will complete generation 6. Which is the orange gen. Alani's gen. Um... So hopefully we get to um, finish generation 6 today and then also age up the toddlers into children so we can start to actually play with them. And keep in mind to like look at the, the kids when we do play with them because I haven't yet decided who's gonna be the heir for the next generation. It could be either or. So I want your input on like what we should do. Mm. I am doing good. Thank you for asking, Tia. Sorry, I'm a little bit behind with the messages. I want to go through everyone. Yeah, and <laughs> Nike. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Although this kind of helps you. I don't have a weird angle on my on my arm. Um. Yes, I, I'm good. I went to work and then I got to go home, which is the best thing ever. <laughs> My day is just babysit my cousin's son, so basically just accompany him to watch cartoon on YouTube. Well, that's awesome. If it's a good cartoon too, that's my kind of day. <laughs> mm. Thank you so much for watching me. So love filming right now. So saw you went live and thought I'd pop in. Ah, that's so nice. T and I've been cooking up more, so we are excited for all to see. Yes. Good job. I'm your number one, number one fan right now. <laughs> Hi, Master Moo. Welcome to the stream. Mm, oh my goodness. Take their vo votes. It feels like Among Us. <laughs> yes. I remember Claire actually did an Among Us video in The Sims. Like Sims in the... In, like Among Us idea and concept. But in The Sims that was really, really funny. Also, thank you so much for telling the story of the murder mysteries. I mean, about murder, it means me of... Reminds me of your play of Black Widow Challenge. Yes, that was an unhinged challenge. I need to shower because of aforementioned dancing, so I'll just be listening. All right. I love your stream. Thank you. Can I call you Ada? Is that okay? Or you could tell me uh, another name you want to be referred to. See you later. Yes, see you later. Have a good shower. 
Um, I mean, Alani's story is interesting so far, and then I wonder who will get picked as the heir generation seven. Yes, we'll get we'll get to see that. Uh, maybe not today, not in today's stream, but soon. Mm. Guys, do you have any pick of your favorite twins? Well, we don't know much about the twins yet. Actually, that reminds me of that we should probably get into the game. Where we can uh, see two very sad toddlers. <laughs> oh my goodness, why, why do they look like that? Mm, two very, very sad looking toddlers. So we have Flynn on the left and then Veronica on the right. And these are the babies that will age up into Generation 7. Well, they are Generation 7. But one of the one of these is gonna be the heir then. <laughs> okay. Mm, I think it is in it's the middle of the night. Uh, let me put this. Can you hear this music if I put it like lower? I don't know if I should have this or not. Do you want me to add, like, have music on the background? And do you wish to have Sims or do you wish to have, um, like, something like lo fi or something like that? Like, chill music. Oh, I forgot my bread. <laughs> my bread is still here. Mm. The house you used for the last video about Animal Crossing Legacy is so majestic. Thank you. I am so excited for you to see. I've been filming and making videos in advance for next month because then I'll be unable to. It's so iconic. It is so iconic. I love it. Because mm. I've been filming it in advance. I have like the whole next month filmed and I already know what happens in episode 20 three no 24 i'm on episode 24 in uh animal crossing legacy whereas i think the 20 episode 20 went live this week mm. so yeah i i don't want to say anything but it's, ooh, it's i i promised <clears throat> i promised you drama and you you got drama <laughs> <laughs> mm, Seura means sound in Indonesia. Oh, there's like four family members and two dogs. Yes, we have lots of um, lots of people in this house, and also um, oh, um, is it just a dog? I thought one of the toddlers would uh, was gonna wake up, but no. Okay, what's wrong with you? You need we. And since you are okay, and you are, oh no, I was just gonna say hungry, you're gonna take care, who are you ta- <gasps> Oh yeah, I forgot their grandma died last episode. <laughs> no, no, that's not very good, okay. Let me drag some food for them. For the breakfast. Let's do cheesy bread. Grab a serving of that. Yes, this is how we take care of our toddlers in this house. <laughs> Sims 3 music. I love, I love Sims 3. Uh, Sims 2 and Sims 3 are just, they're so good. I love the music. Good one, you can pick that. I really haven't played Sims 3 much. I played for a long time. No, stop doing that. Um, are you? No. Oh my god. No, you... <laughs> You're eating. <laughs> You're eating all the food. That's for the babies. No. <laughs> are you kidding me? Okay, please. Why can I not? Okay. <gasps> Amazing. Copper learned not to... Um, Eat the food. That is awesome. Uh, okay, we have some weird clipping going on. 
Yes, now I was gonna make you go ahead and bake some more because today that's all you're gonna be doing. <laughs> let's be do, um, let's be doing, no. Let's do some lemon bars. And where are we with your skill? Baking, baking. Level eight. Okay, we still have a little bit of <laughs> little bit to go, but we can do it. Timmy definitely loves living in that house. I would love to live in Timmy's house. The the Nook house, although expensive and kind of empty currently, because we haven't had the money to. Oh my God! No, no, not you too. Not you too. Oh no! Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Okay. Both of them have learned stuff, which is good. And I keep forgetting about my bread. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'll have to just eat it at the same time. Otherwise, I'll just forget it. Today, you need to get her into baking skill. Max! I do need to do that. Mm. Oh, wow. Look, it's a blizzard. No wonder my... my PC sounds like it's taking off. Okay. You are having... Oh my god, not you too. <laughs> this is hard. How do I... Oh, I'm in the wrong sim, sorry. I need to... Parent you. Firm. Express disappointment. Firm. Disappointment for making a mess. We don't like you doing that. We have Winterfest, that is tomorrow. Awesome. And then we also forgot our lemon bars in the cooker. Not great. Or in the oven. It is Christmassy. That is true. We should probably celebrate some kind of Christmas. I never see something like this, so I could imagine this is really beautiful. You've never seen snow? Is that right? Now that... Why are you sad? Oh, you're sad. Okay. Maybe we can com comfort you. Mm, how do I do that? I don't know how to do that, so instead I'll just teach to say sorry. Amazing parenting. Mm. She's gonna be asleep for a little bit still, which is good. No? You don't want to? Okay. We are, I'm trying to build their conflict resolution on other traits. The issue I'm having is that mm, they're don't, they don't really seem to go up. Also, why is our responsibility going down and I'm teaching him to say sorry? I don't really understand that. But yeah, I don't feel like toddlers can like... Do much with these. I don't really understand it. Because every time I try, they just don't do anything. So I don't know how that works. Oh, I'm so sorry. So sorry about that. Mm, can you poly train Flynn and then we need to polish the or the we need to get rid of the smell that looks horrible. <laughs> I don't get any snow here either. Wow. It's been snowing all day in real life for me. <laughs> so Fortunately, it was sunny too, so it all almost all has been has melted. But oh my god, can you um clean that potty and then you can get some something to eat, so get leftovers. There we go. And knowing one of them will become air is so good. I love the twins. Yes, I like them too. <gasps> Amazing time. It's almost their birthday, <clears throat> which means it will be tomorrow, right? Yes. 
Oh, they age up on Winterfest. Okay. So we're celebrating Winterfest and we're also celebrating their birthday. All right. All right. Who's calling me now? Mm, no. We live under a rock. You don't know where we live, so you can't come over. <laughs> I live in Finland. So the almost the most north Europe you can go. Like almost. We used to have one of the like we call it arms if you look at the map the finnish borders look like a lady we used to have two arms up like this but after the war with russia we lost the other one and that one was previously connected to the uh, north pole well not the actual north pole but to the to the sea I don't know the name of the sea in English, but the ice ocean. <laughs> um, but not anymore, as I just explained, we lost it. So now Norway and Russia are actually the most northest countries. And I think just maybe, no, I think, I don't think Russia, e uh, sorry, Sweden either has a... Um, Oh, wow, you're s what? I gave you food. Why are you hungry? Okay. Why are you doing some weird glitches? That looked really bizarre. Do we have a... Yes, we do. Okay. Give food to Veronica and let's give her peas because that's some nutritious food and not sugary stuff. And I forget again that they have to walk all, o all over to the high chair and then back again to get to Donner. <laughs> the worst thing ever. Mm, you've never seen snow either. That's that's interesting. Obviously, I know there are lots of places with without snow, so it's not like, wow, but... <laughs> It's still, I find it interesting that people have such a different environment and where they, like, what they're used to and all that. I am used to, uh, like, at least a meter of snow in the winter. <laughs> so, very different. I put Is This Dream on my TV whilst I'm reading Powerless! Ooh, I need to know what the, uh, what you think about the book when you're finished with it. I don't remember if I have the book, but I've like looked at it many times. Mm, and I've heard a lot of positive things about it. I love that. I, I always love when I get to speak to fellow bookworms because it's so much fun. Currently I'm reading, what are you doing now? A garden salad and we have fridge full of food. Okay, weirdo. <laughs> um, currently, I am reading... Um, what is it called? Death and Croissants. The book is right there. <laughs> That's why I needed to look that way. Mm. I'm in South Texas, so we don't get snow. No, I don't wonder you do. That is cool. That is so cool. I just... Um, was editing a video uh, that my sims lived in a jungle and went with a very like Mexican vibe. I know it's not Mexico, but still it's like similar vibe in my eyes. <laughs> oh my God, I am so uneducated when, when, it, when it comes to like the States because they're like the States are almost as far away from me uh, as you could go like australia is further but then comes the states <laughs> mm. i uh, uh i'm in indonesia yes cyrus did tinkering yes Cy cyrus fixed uh the, the dollhouse like an angel i don't want to control him too much so did you eat? Oh, I think she ate her little salad. Can you clean that up and let her out? Are you... F oh, you're actually fine. She's probably having... 
Oh, she likes the peas. That's nice. Um, can we actually go ahead and, I don't know, teach her something? Mm. Where is the... No. I can never find the... Options to flashcards. There we go. Flashcards. Let's do teach animals. I forgot what their skills are actually. Mm. Okay. Communication too. We can work on that. And then thinking. We also need to work on that. And then Flynn. You're all up again. Can Cyrus actually give you some food please let's do some peas as well i find that giving toddlers normal hu human normal adult food like from normal plates where they can just get grab a serving they don't really eat it like they eat some of it but not all of it and it usually doesn't help too much with their um hunger so I like to still have the high chair option to give them like peas and stuff to help with that. Mm. Okay. Oh wow, we got to level potty. Uh, level potty. Level three potty. And imagination is almost four, like a sliver before it's gonna be four. And communication is also gonna be four soon. We can work on these. Okay, we can get communication and imagination to level 4 for sure. And we're probably going to be able to get communication and thinking, hopefully, to level 4. They're really sad because their grandma died. Because, to be honest, the grandma was more a mother to them for a long time than their actual mother. So, I don't blame them. I'm also reading Powerless. I highly recommend. That's cool. Are you doing like a, a book club thingy where you read the books together or just happen to read the same book? Don't worry, I'm so invested in this. Communication and imagination is almost to the max. Yes. We also need to take the doggies to a walk. Sorry, I thought I heard my cat, but I don't think he's here. Okay, what's going on in here? Can you let him out of the high chair? Mm, let out. And maybe you two can play with dolls while... Oh, you're tired. Okay. You can go have a nap while Alani takes Pickles. Yeah, Pickles out because Pickles, Pickles was asking. Asking to go out where is it go on a jog actually i know it's a bit like it's not good to leave the toddlers all alone in this house but there's literally nothing going on and uh they have me <laughs> i will i will volunteer i will watch the toddlers alani asks my help for my help and i will give it to her <laughs> Oh my god, is it a blizzard? For real? Yes. Oh my god. Okay, you know what? I'm a little bit tired of the blizzard. It's not... It's not very fun. I'm gonna get rid of it. Mm, snow. Okay. Hopefully, it's just snow. Maybe? Or maybe I need to restart my game. I don't know. Um... Are you jogging inside or going... Okay, she's gone out outside. What are you doing? Seriously. <laughs> Come on. That was the shortest walk I've ever seen. You can do better. And why are you still up? You should be sleeping. Oh, you're just because you're slow. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. <laughs> mm, I think Alani can replace Mila's... Uh, well, of course she's going to replace Mila's role. But Alani didn't have the the option to raise her kids from the start because of the whole situation with the criminal gang and 
everything. If you haven't watched my Mishinima, that explains what's going on. So, um, yeah, she just d didn't have the option. Um, but it, it takes a while for the kids to obviously get to know their mom and be like okay with her being the main caregiver. Mm, I would kind of call it a book club. There's like four of us reading the same book right now. That's so awesome. I love that. I would, I would absolutely love to be in a book club. However, I feel like I would definitely not be able to read the books then because I usually struggle with reading when I have to read like if I can just pick up a, a book and start it and then like I get to it on my own pace I have no problems but then sometimes even if I have decided the book it doesn't have to be like somebody else tells me which book they read I decide a book from my bookcase, I'm like, oh, I haven't read this one, I'll read this one. And I'll put it on the, like, table, ready for me, like, this is the book you'll read, right? And my brain goes like, um, actually. <laughs> like, I can't choose them like that. I have to pick a book and then start it. If I continue it, like, the first pages, I continue reading it. Then I'm like, okay, I'll read this one. If I start it, or if I don't start it, it's not going to be read. And if I start it and I just can't get into it, I'm not going to read it <laughs> again. <laughs> so, um, yeah, it's a bit... I would love to be part of a book club, but I don't think for me it would be a possibility. Like, I'd find somehow a reason to not do it. <laughs> Even if the reason was just that I don't want to read the book anymore. <laughs> mm, go, a nice go jog with pickles, but in the middle of a blizzard, I wonder how. Well, as a Finn, I walk in the br blizzard every winter, so it's not so hard. It's a bit hard to see sometimes, but otherwise it's not that hard. <laughs> the end, I got some of... Um, of the same book so we are reading some together that's really really cool I really like that I hope we have a very long lasting book club it's Cyrus who takes pickles to jog yes because both of the dogs need um, what okay interesting choice but a choice nonetheless <laughs> instead of doing that could you maybe I don't know bake or work on your baking skill somehow. Let's do a fish pie. Mm, and then we need to pee. She'll need to pee soon. And how is your... Okay, you are fixing your potty. Is it, is it like advancing? It's advancing, but quite slowly. So not the best. And communication or imagination. Okay, no, we're not doing that. Instead, go play dolls because you can push your um, imagination to a, a four, level four. I love this unbreakable dollhouse. I mean, it broke several times, but still <laughs> holding on. <laughs> yes, Cyrus thankfully did. Um... Oh no, this is broken. Okay. Uh, you can take a bath. We can just replace this one. Level 9! Great. Great news. Awesome. I'm very proud of you. Mm. Yes, the dollhouse is amazing. You can always just repair it and... It's good again. I'm so glad you can't break it, like, for real. Like, un... Un... Not unbreakable. What the word is? Like, it's not forever gonna be broken and I need a new one. You know, that kind of broken. <laughs> Unrepairable, that's what I was looking for. Mm, I'm just going to pretend that she plays the woody doll and treat it like a superman and swing it around. You kind of... 
you're kind of right though. Like if you look at what they do with the dolls, they kind of use them like, oh, it's flying like that. I love the china near the table, the plant pot near the table. Oh, this one, right? Or maybe this one, which, which table? <laughs> Um, we have lots of plants. I love plants. Like, me, personally, I also have lots of plants in my, in my house. Who, oh wow, what is going on? Mm, what are you gonna do? Ask for a boss. We can, f for sure, we can give you a boss. We are also really stinky, but, um, I guess that's what comes when you have kids. <laughs> No boss for you, only boss for kids. You are also, it's so much work to take care of these toddlers, by the way. Like, so much work. <laughs> I need to constantly be looking after them. Wait, no. What are you doing? She asked you for a boss. Why are you going? F oh my goodness. And she's not even, like, listening. I cancelled the action. And she's like, nope. I'm smelly. I am taking this bath. <laughs> Seriously. You still have a little bit of, like, learning when it comes to kids. Do you have work? Okay. You would have work tomorrow. However, it's Winterfest. So I don't think he has work then. Otherwise, he's doing well. I'm not really focusing on him, but I do like to, like, work on his, like, what he wants and stuff. Because sometimes we do get into a situation like this one. Uh, where we are having, like, a midlife crisis and I don't know how to, <laughs> how to figure it out. Mm. Uh, can you get something to eat? And then, I don't know, do something. We're giving Veronica a boss. And Flynn... Why do you not... Like, is there, so, is there something wrong with these beds? Because his energy doesn't go up. Like, barely. Maybe, like, 1%. He woke up, like, halfway. And then woke up again. Because I put him to bed. Or Alani put him to bed. Uh, once before it was like um, yellow and now it's red like obviously we've been awake but also we've been sleeping sometimes so I don't know what's going on with that one mm, I wonder where sh does she go I love the uh, oh no sorry the crescent moon one the crescent moon one which one is a crescent moon I don't know. A crescent moon. I'm sorry, but I don't know which one you're talking about. But anyways. Great. <laughs> I'm happy you like it. Mm, okay. Or do you mean the mirror? If you mean the mirror, um, or this one, it's a mirror. Okay, she's so busy with the toddlers that she's um, not even sad. Although I don't know if she would be sad because she is an evil sim. Like obviously I'm saying that she is sad that her mom passed. But I don't know if evil sims do get like sad when a sim dies. Okay, what's up with you? What's going on? Why does Cyrus feel this way? Why has life taken such a negative turn? Oh my god. You're so hard to, to figure out. Okay. How are you doing with your skills now? Communication could be on level 2. What are you doing? Ask for comfort. Oh my goodness. That's so cute. Um, no. She's just ignoring me. Okay. Instead of ignoring your toddler... <laughs> Could yes. you maybe um, teach her to talk? 
Yes, that one. Yes, I also like it. It came with the werewolf pack, this one. I really like it. Okay. We're gonna hopefully uh, level up her communication. And after that, we could level up her potty. She doesn't really need um, the toilet. She does need some food, though. So, actually, just give her peas. <laughs> She's more filled that way. Let's give her some peas. Lots of staring going on. Not the not the most active teaching method for for talking, but what do I know? I'm just gonna fast forward a little bit because it takes forever. Okay, we reached a level three of the the ta um, communication skill. How many times will pickles be? sprayed by a skunk it's been a third time now <laughs> third three times in one day okay we have peas for her and after that we need to work on her potty skill so pick her up and put her there and then we can have a nap while she eats her peas although usually they eat really really fast so i don't know if she'll have time to <laughs> even <laughs> Go take a nap in the time she takes to eat it. Okay, you want to sit there instead? Fine, nap in there. Why are you tense for the... F for this? Okay. And as I said, <laughs> she's already... Already... Um... Already, already. <laughs> That's a weird sentence. Um, let's clean the potty and then get her to... Well, I know it's so gross to put a toddler on a potty. That's so gross. But doesn't it... Like, it doesn't really make sense for me to then put her there and she does her business and then it's smelly again. I'd rather just clean it up once. But it does feel a little bit bad to, like, put her there. And it's gross. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so glad I don't have kids my own. You can't wait, Veronica, to age up. I can't wait for them to age up so we can get to uh, uh, look at what they look like. Because I'm always so interested in the genetics. And since I don't edit my sims ever, unless they completely lose their chin, I give them a little bit of a chin. Or something like that, like, some a feature is completely bugged because of the sims genetics, then I will fix it. However, um... Oh my god, we need to bathe you. However, I don't, like, go and modify their, or even tweak their appearances ever, because... I want to see what they, like, look like, the, the, like, genetics. Back, but also preparing some food. Yes, what food are you making? Let me know. I also need to figure out some food before I go to sleep, sleep because I'm hungry and uh, I need some food. <laughs> Surprisingly, that's what you do. <laughs> Okay, go to sleep and then hopefully we're able to... Did we actually start something? I don't think we started anything. Okay, let's bake. Before we go to bed, let's bake fudge bars. Oh my god, I want that as well. <laughs> oh, I, I wish I could level up my baking or I needed to level up my baking skill that would be great <laughs> okay we're getting rid of the smell which is good and copper I would like no why are you up 
You're still hungry. Jesus Christ. Okay. How are your skills? Mm, communication could be better. So instead of baking, you're going to be teaching your son to talk. So both of them will be able to talk, hopefully. Oh my god. This is so hard as a single parent. It's hard when you have multiple, like caregivers as well because then they kind of overlap and the kids go and ask something from one parent and then the person you sent to like take care of them can't take care of them so it's a mess as well but also it's hard when you only have one person so i know i need a coffee machine that's what i that's what i need do we have one no okay i'll well, it doesn't actually matter because we're going to age them up tomorrow. So just get through this one last day and then we can bake their... This time, usually I only do one cake, but this time I'll bake both of them their own cakes. I think she's going to pass out before he's... No, okay. I don't... We could pass out before he levels up. No, okay. Great, it's Winterfest. Be oh my god. <laughs> We've pulled an all-nighter with these kids. She is up until 6 a.m. Great job. We also need to give him food. Because he's really hungry. I can't wait for them to age up. Literally cannot wait. <laughs> oh my goodness. I have soup, so I'm just going to boil some pieces of potato to put in into it. That's nice. I also want soup now. Oh, sorry, I didn't I didn't fix this. Okay. Before you go, I could have just dragged it closer, but I'm sorry. I didn't think about this. It's so nonsense. They should pick the toddler up first and put it in the chair and then the food putting the food there first doesn't make any sense but I can't be bothered to put Flynn down here then click on him to give him food it's so like tedious that way that I rather do it the official way okay can you nap on the couch for a little bit what is your problem I'm not sure and then you need to clean this once you've read your um gotten a little bit of energy oh okay he's ready he's ready unfortunately let him out and he can take himself himself to bed <laughs> sorry but or actually you know what let's do a bedtime story sorry the other way I think it works, even though I said it, like, on him. Okay, I feel like it does work. <clears throat> and Cyrus is up. Can you, um, talk to somebody on social networking? socialize oh okay chat with do you have anybody okay this is your friend okay good Hello. i know you're tired but so is your toddler come on you can do it i i trust you you can do it there we go I don't know what this story is about. It's always about the same princess, but these change. Okay, wow, okay. <laughs> now finally, go sleep. I know she's really hungry. I'll deal with that in the morning, or it is the morning. I'll deal with that in a bit. <clears throat> but first she needs to sleep because she was about to pass out. 
and both the kids are gonna sleep for a little bit so we're left with you okay he's social is slowly getting getting better i think that's enough because we'll have time to socialize when we get to um the part where everyone's up <laughs> in this household except for you and maybe we can give the doggies a little bit attention because they're not really getting much attention <laughs> these days i don't know if my mod for kids to go um out with dogs still works i used to have a mod that let kids walk dogs mm, because it doesn't make any sense to me that kids wouldn't be able to walk their pets like it it doesn't make any sense why the ho i don't want to i don't like to be negative i like i really don't like to be negative and hate this game or i don't hate this game but hate on this game um but sometimes there are just things i really don't understand and the cats and dogs pack is one of them like it has so many features that just don't make any sense that i just like who who thought of this <laughs> like whose idea was this i just don't get it i don't get it but that's why i have a gazillion mods in my game <laughs> it's a problem okay are you taking him out for a walk no do you want to take him on a walk you can go on a short walk this time you don't have to run you don't always have to go on a jog we can then hopefully take also copper no copper sorry pickles um if we'll if we'll have time are these changing at all upgrade two times Hmm, I could do that. I could get some upgrading parts from the web. Because I don't think you have any, no. I hope your mod is always okay. Yeah, well, they do break when an, a new thing is added to the game, usually. Depends of the thing and the mod. But sometimes they do break, which is unfortunate. Also, why can't you walk two dogs? Why was that also too difficult? I could have even taken a rabbit hole, to be honest. I don't need to be walking, like physically go on a walk and with my sim and my dog. I I like the option, but um, it could have, like, they could have just added rabbit holes to, like, walking multiple dogs. Like, you could, like, choose all your dogs and walk them that way. I know there is a mod for that, but again, I think it's been broken. But yeah, sometimes I just don't get it. It's the same thing that I don't understand why we don't have more careers. Almost all careers are rabbit holes anyway. So what is it? Like, what's the reason we don't have, like, more of it? They could have just given, like, different branches for, like, medical careers. Like a nurse or a doctor of different kinds. Like, I'd like to know that my, my sim is, like, a psychiatrist. Like, I'd love to do that. I don't need to go to the work place myself. Like, obviously, that's fun. I love active careers. But not every career needs to be active. So I'm completely fine with not, like, having that. But I don't... Like, why can't they just, like, add a, a job or hobbies, too, that are, like, rabbit holes? I just It's so weird. I don't understand. I don't really understand. Okay. I think that's good enough. Mm, are you walking home or are you... Sometimes he gets stuck. Let me just speed up so I can see where he goes. Okay, I think he's going back home. Um, Alani, unfortunately, you'll, get, you'll have to get up because we have two cakes that we need to make. Um... Use that, and then I know you're hungry. 
So, go get leftovers. And let's hope that the twins still stay asleep until we're ready to celebrate stuff. <laughs> Well, I, I know my sim is not a psychiatrist. I would love them to be, but there is no job to be a... Like, there's no option to be a psychiatrist in the game. Why you... The rat race. The Cyrus has an intense desire to be more successful in life. Well, it's not my fault that you don't work on Winterfest. <laughs> Can't really help you there, buddy. You are also hungry, so maybe you can get some leftovers. Where are you? Oh, you're coming in. Okay, that's nice. Whose house is that so feel Christmassy with green and more color? It's probably our neighbor's house. Um, that you saw. This one. Or... I don't remember where we were. This one is not a house. This is like a... Public lot that I still need to get rid of. But I have not... Where are you going? I asked for you to... <laughs> oh my goodness. And I see... Oh no, it was copper. Pickles, sorry. Mm, I thought it was a toddler. A rogue toddler, but no, it's pickles. Okay. <laughs> Cyrus is a mid middle age crisis for him. I know. But it's so difficult. Look at what he needs to be doing. Brag 15 times and I don't even have the option. I've looked for it. It's probably... Maybe gossip. Or... Small talk. I've looked for it, but I can't find it. I literally cannot find the brag. Because he's not a... Um, it's not his personality to be, like, braggy. So I don't know how to do it. It just says friendly interactions. Oh, oh, and, like, oh. yeah. But then what? There's, like, so many things you can do under friendly. And then I need to reach the max level in a career. How do you do that in just, like, a, a couple of days? Like, what? Upgrade two items is fine. And then he wants to become... Um, a businessman. He wants to switch to business career. But if I switch him to business career. We're definitely not maxing the level. Uh, the career. So like. What do you want from me? <laughs> I'm just. My tactic is. Just ignoring it. And since you're up. I would really appreciate it. If you would be baking cakes. Instead of trolling the throw rooms. So. Oh no, but this is not baking. This won't count as a baking level up. Like, we're not baking the cake. That is so annoying. Okay. I have a... F oh, I clicked it, sorry. I have a feeling that winter cake does not support birthday candles. I've tried it before, but I don't think that's possible. And I don't want to waste time. So even though I love this cake. I wish you could have it for a birthday cake. And if somebody has had it for a birthday cake. Without any mods allowing that. Let me know. Because I I think I've tried it before. But we're going to be doing two strawberry cakes. Of course we're going to be doing a pink cake. What does he want? Just chatting. Okay. And then, do we have any, like, immediate family members that are still alive? Mm. <laughs> okay, doesn't look very good. However, Mercury and Slate and Viral are all still living. So, I'm thinking... Before they all, like, go, maybe we should ask them to come over. Because it would be nice to have some family around, I think. It's it's um Winterfest anyways, so I think it's... Oh my god, she's cooking in Bil Miller's kitchen, isn't it? Oh, she took the stuff from Miller's kitchen, but 
decided she wanted to cook in her kitchen. Okay. Okay, okay. Mm, I don't think you're gonna be able to kick soccer ball with anybody. So instead, you're gonna sell this and then I'm gonna make you paint something. <laughs> Hopefully that helps some, I don't know, some aspect of your of your brain wanting some change. All right, let's speed up a little bit. Or not. My game does not look, uh, does not like this, the three speed. Okay, don't you touch it. Let's put some birthday candles on it. And then we need to bake. Should I bake another one if it's not gonna? Nah, I'm not gonna. I'm gonna bake something else. It's not counting as a baking skill anyway, so I don't want to waste my time. <gasps> carrot cake. We could do carrot cake. Let's do that. That's actually my favorite cake. Mercury Slate and Viral are still alive. They are like your uncle and aunts. I want I would love to see the result of his painting. We'll see, we'll see. Don't worry. He is painting oh <laughs> he is painting the same painting that he was painting before. Love that. And we're getting ready with these. How much does it like how quickly does this go up? Not very. Oh, nice. He, he does like painting. Okay, great. All right. You know what? I'm going to be painting until the toddlers wake up. And if they do wake up before this is done, then I'll just bake this one. <laughs> you never know, do you? Since you were enjoying the paintings admire it that's nice and then sell it to somebody and then we can paint another one <laughs> the bones yeah it's a weird painting but it's fine it is fine doesn't have to be amazing okay uh, next thing i really needed to do this but oh actually i don't look it's <gasps> and one of the toddlers is awake Oh, no. Okay. Can you... Let's put down Veronica here. And then... I'll give her peace. What is going on? Why are you walking? Why are you the one walking? Rocket science is his thing. And wants to do more... Do it more often. <gasps> no, why you No. Why do you <laughs> You sneaky little Ugh, why'd you take that? I asked you to Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Now we just have this half eaten cake that we're gonna serve people. Well obviously she's gonna have to um what is happening no can you for real shut up if you say one more word i'm putting your com communication back to zero okay before he she screams i will give her food Don't you dare open your mouth. Keep it closed. Okay. We have peace. Oi, we have peace. And peace. <laughs> Go ahead and bake another cake. We can't serve a half-eaten cake. That's just unacceptable. It's our family, but still. I just can't. <laughs> I can't serve a half-eaten cake. 
And you'll just have to be there until you... Um, do you have a, a toy? No, you do not. Where are you? You are on the PC. Can you actually... Mm. Who's calling? Somebody's calling. Nope. We're not doing that. Cyrus will take care of, of um, yeah. Veronica for a little bit. I might... Um, I might call her Ronnie as short. Because Veronica is such a long name. And he's unlocked the single and loving it lifestyle. Can you not? Can you for real? Are you for real? Why is nobody ever listening to me? I need to like... I don't know. Put some fences around the house so I can like... Um... Ask if good or bad. Teach basic needs. Okay, there we go. What are you doing? No. Can you... Oh, I... Th no. I don't think she was gonna resume that. I think she was gonna cook something else. Oh, maybe. I don't know. I need to, like, fence off some, like, places. So I can, like, force her to be in the kitchen. <laughs> I can feel the love in this selfie. <laughs> yes. I bet. I bet. I would love to see the result of his painting. What did he paint this time? Oh my god, don't you dare take a piece of that. Okay, it's fine. It's good. Everything's good. It's- Oh, it's 7 p.m. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, why does the time fly like this? Okay, we need- We need- Um... If I do a social event, will it cancel Winterfest then? I never know. I'll just ask for them to come over. It's fine. I'll do it that way. Mm. If we even know them. I hope we do. Actually, we know... Oh, we do actually know them. We also know Malia, uh, Rhea and... Um, what their sister is called. I don't really actually I'll just do a plan uh, plan a social event. It's fine. If it cancels Winterfest, I'm just gonna get rid of their um like the sadness if they get sad when the thing the plan um Winterfest is over. Mercury Slate of Varro still alive. They Oh yes, I read that. They're like aunt, aunts and uncles. Yes, they do. Are, uh, they they are definitely. Okay. Um, we need a. I think. What is a family reunion? And a dinner party. I guess dinner party? Because they are supposed to... Um, they are supposed to... Be eating, so I guess. Okay. Now, we need... Malia. Then... Uh, what's her surname? Volkov. Okay, she hasn't married. Mm, then we need... Sorry, they're loading a little little slow. Mercury. We barely know her. Huh? That's not great. Or Slate, either. Or Viral. They're our only living family and we barely even know them. That's not great. Rhea. And... Was it Brianna? I think it's Brianna, but... Has she aged up? I'm not sure because she doesn't look like the same that I made over, but she could have changed over time. But I, I can't remember her surname. I'm not gonna ask her to come over because I don't know her surname and I don't 
know if it's her for sure. And I also don't know her kid, so I don't want to take her away from her kid. Although I'm pretty sure um, Molly also has a kid, but let's just not <laughs> focus on that. And it's going to be in our house and hopefully everyone's gonna join us oh my god you are sleeping the whole day <gasps> and you are dirty too oh my goodness can you give him a bath <laughs> can you give flynn a bath <laughs> this is so unacceptable where is everyone okay they're coming over we need some stuff so we can serve people let's open our fridge mm -hmm. there we go okay we can have some garlic noodles some muffins or stuff then we have cookies and a so many carrot cakes <laughs> carrot cake sorry a carrot cake and some lemon stuff some bread and why can i not put anything here that's weird okay that's enough we have lots of food on the table they don't want to go on the table but that's fine actually you know what let's put them on this table doesn't make sense that we're just cram cramming everything on that side and then nobody's gonna be able to eat. So everyone will just come here and get food. <clears throat> no, 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 no. What are you doing? There's food all over the counter. Stop. Stop. Just put it. Take it. Take it. Put it in your... <laughs> Where can I put this? Okay, clean it up. And then let's start with the garlic noodles. Are you not? Father Winter is here. Can we? Can we not? Are we having a dinner party or not? That is such a weird thing. Okay. Can I make a group of all of us? Slate, Viral, Mercury, Molly, and Rhea. Okay. Everyone's here. And let's grab a serving together. Oh my god. This is stressful. Having dinner parties in The Sims is always so stressful. I put the soup in my biggest bowl and added the potatoes and it's still almost overflowing. Oh no. Okay. If somebody takes a slice of this cake i will be screaming hopefully not though and they're actually okay she's still eating there could we i don't know eat at the dinner table would would you i don't know no okay i should have probably added him to the group as well let me oh i can't okay never mind then okay i need to make some more effort I need to get to know some of my... We're gonna ask about the food, what he thought about the food. And then I need to get to know them. Can I have to get to know, please? Yes, there we go. Because I don't know my my family very well. We know Rhea. We do like Rhea. They had a little bit of a weird friendship at some point. In their... Um, lifetime <laughs> she didn't always get along with everybody amazingly so i understand that and uh also anytime she's wearing like form-fitting clothes i always look at her i'm like how is well sim is not real but like she has such insane proportions it's a little bit worrying honestly but that's just how she came to the world. Like I've never done any I have never done anything. Never done anything, is that right? Like I haven't done 
anything to fix her like form. I've never made her more skinny. I've never put, made her butt bigger. Like I've I've never edited edited anything. But she just came out like like a freaking brat stall. <laughs> it's so funny. Okay. Now we need to um we need to blow some candles. Okay. You Veronica first. Was it Veronica? I can't remember. Maybe it was Flynn first. I can't remember. I think it was Veronica, but I'm not sure. Okay. Let's help out her. Blow candles, can you? Would you, please? What are you going to do now? Okay, I don't know what they're going to gonna do, but I need you to blow out the candles because otherwise... Oh my god, oh my god, I need a good look of your face. Because I can't remember what you looked like. Oh my god, you look like a demon. <laughs> I need her to look at the camera, so... Okay, there we go. I think she has freckles. Yes, she has a little bit of freckles. And... That's all. That's all. <laughs> Hopefully I can figure out what she looked like and which um, skin she had. Okay, she's aging up. No, don't. Nobody dare take this. If somebody takes this, we're gonna have a problem. Um, where can I put it so it's... It's not on the center. Well, no shit. I still can't put it. I cannot put it on the center. Why is it not possible to put on the center of the thing? Come on. Okay, add birthday candles now. Okay! Um, Angelic. I'm gonna add both of their... Uh, both of them the trait that needs to be for the next... Next generation. Let me look at it. Um, we need... Neat, unflirty, or creative. I think I'm gonna give them creative. Oops. Because, um... That's the most, like, child-friendly trait. Although, I could give one of them neat and one of them creative. I'm pretty sure a kid can be neat as well. Mm. She has good creativity, so for at least for her, I'm gonna give the creativity. And then for their aspiration, they're going to be a best-selling author, but we can't do that just now. So I'm thinking smartest kid in school, artistic prodigy, social butterfly, some party, playtime captain, creative genius, mind and body. The sim wants to master both their mind and body. I'm not gonna give them motor. Um, maybe. I'll give her the creative one. We need desperately more stuff for kids. No. Can you just, for the love of God, put the candles on it? Okay. And now help Flynn. Because we need two two kids. We all we don't leave one of them to be a toddler. Um Flutty is also kind of childlike. When was the last time you had children flirting with you? <laughs> yes, but all all children should be <laughs> unflirty. <laughs> That's just not something you you do. So I'm not gonna add that. 
Oh, look at her. We don't even have a neat treat for her and she's still cleaning. What an absolute chump. Love that. I absolutely love that. Continue, please. <laughs> I mean, the air will be like you. I remember when I asked what will be your trait if become sim, you say gloomy, creative, and unflirty. Change the gloomy into needs. True. That is true. Okay. Flynn is also aging up, and I forgot to take a picture. Whatever. And he's more social. Um, so I think for him, I'm gonna give... Maybe for him, I'll give neat. So they're not exactly the same. And then for his aspiration, we're gonna give him the social butterfly. Oh, look at them. They're cute. Okay. Now you may take a piece of this. Everyone, take a piece. Although you should probably also take a piece of your um, own birthday cake. Otherwise, it wouldn't make any sense. I forgot that Mercury is an uh, alien. I was like w wondering why her... Oh my god, she doesn't have a... No, not Mila's ghost. <laughs> Mila, for real. Oh my god. Even in her grave, she's cleaning for us. Absolutely the best kind of person. <laughs> oh my god. Well, at least we had a good... Mm, good Winterfest, I think. I think it's a, it's been a nice winter fest. You're still hungry. You could eat the leftover cookie that one of the twin twins left over, and maybe some fruit cake. Oh, you're not hungry anymore. What am what am I saying? You are hungry. No, I want carrot cake. Thanks. Yeah, <laughs> me too. <laughs> so it's both of us. Suffering in silence or not so much in silence. She's haunting the 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 box of cereals Why are you angry? Sugar and now okay great Great job. Where are you? I need to give their them their room <laughs> Okay, I think I'm gonna um, Just give them beds and then for the next episode, before I stream, I will give them a room. And um, for this episode, I'm all, only gonna give them their cast makeovers. So I'm gonna put this somewhere so I can drag the, this one over. There. And then I'll put this one in here. Do we have another bed? No, but we... Oh, we sold her bed. Okay. We need another bed. I'm gonna get give them good beds. Otherwise, they'll be really sleepy all the time. Hmm... Why are all the beds in this game so trash? I don't want this like fancy ass bed. I want a good bed like a cute bed like this, but then it's trash for their sleeping. I hate that about this game. Okay. Now they have beds. So we can get to bed. And... Where are you? You're about to go to sleep. I mean... She's really tired, so I won't blame her. Let's put these in the fridge. 
And then tomorrow, what's... Oh, no. <laughs> what makes a sim turn neutral? Have a sim stay in fine emotion for 48 straight sim hours. I bet it's Mila because otherwise I don't think so. Yeah, this is what uh, what's the problem with having a party. What are you about to do? Tease about bravery. Okay, that doesn't make any sense. What's wrong with you? Um, that's the issue with having social events on a an actual... No, look at you what you did. You made your sister embarrassed. Are you happy? Mm. They kind of don't update their actual holiday like stuff because the holiday kind of goes away. It doesn't go away, but like, you know what I mean? Like it's, it's still a, a holiday, but it's not appearing on the event. Like the event stuff takes over. So then it's like really bad for them. Well, that's fine. Let's just get rid of all of this. I'm gonna reset you because I don't want you stuck in my kitchen. And you guys, it's 2.40 a.m. I should hope that you go to bed at this hour. Why you, you, you don't... That is not the example we set for the kids. You're not doing yoga at 3 a.m. <laughs> You're going to sleep. Or you should should have been asleep like a long time ago. <laughs> <laughs> she even cleans the kitchen as ghost yes <laughs> you're you're not being exactly silent <laughs> no i do want carrot cake though i wonder what makes mila back to the house it's because i haven't mm, released her urn oh wow it's floating <laughs> wow can we like put it on the ground did we have the yes we do have the um vvs but maybe we can stay there it's fine i just have her hers in here let's release her ghost to the nether to the netherlands as i like to say and um that's it then okay once you have gathered enough energy i'm gonna be baking like a crazy person because i really want you to fix your not fix your level up upgrade your level what am i even saying i need you to get level 10 that's what i'm trying to say Okay, and this will be a little bit easier. Actually, you can go ahead. Oop, I didn't mean to do that. You can go back to sleep once you've released the ghost. Because we really did... We, even though it's nice that she's cleaning. Like, actually really nice. I don't think we should make our dead mother clean for us beyond the grave. I just, I just think that's a little bit wrong to do <laughs> so <laughs> i think we should clean our own messes and release her spirit okay you're good now um so let's go ahead and bake let's bake she's inspired so that's good um let's do chocolate souffle I don't think we've made that one, have we? Maybe we have, I don't re remember. But let's make that. And at the end of this stream, if I can, in like the next 20 minutes or something, if I can get her to level 10, that would be amazing. If I can't, I'll just like get to, or start the, the next, generation anyways <laughs> and then next time i'll like next stream i mean i'll just in the background do her little baking mm. 
I also, this is the first time we have the next generation kind of not ready. Like, I know we can do some of the things as kids. Mm, we can learn skills and we can learn... Um, the We can get the pen pals and stuff. But uh, for the thumbnail, I will also have to put both of them. Because we haven't yet decided which one will be the heir. So... The thumbnail for the next generation will have to change once they become 18 or a young adult. I haven't had a generation change this early in, in this challenge yet, so it's interesting. I wonder... I, I finished the whole bowl and now I'm so full. <laughs> I bet. Okay, next thing. Let's bake since you're, our, you're still inspired. Let's do mm, everything bagels. That's for breakfast. Did I put it? Yes, of course I put it. <laughs> and Flynn has lost a tooth. Oh no, that is not good. Let's brush your teeth, the, the ones that are left. <clears throat> and then yeah. you can go ahead and get some bagels. Huh. And he... Look at him! He has pink hair! Wow, I didn't realize that. No way! He has actually aged up with pink hair. That's so cool. Everything bagels? That sounds delicious. I've never had an everything bagel. But I love bagels. I absolutely love a cream cheese and onion bagel. Or a um, cream cheese and... Where, where are you going? Oh, okay. Or a cream cheese and uh, salmon bagel, bagel. That's also really good. Okay. Now, you can come here and sit and grab a serving of bagels. Why do you always go sit on the chair? Okay, fine. You can have a serving of a bagel and sit with your your son. Look at them having breakfast. That's so nice. He's actually aged up relatively looking like himself. Lots of freckles. I don't think he had that many freckles. But he has pink hair. He has somewhat pinky-ish um, eyes. He might have... Um, oh my... Pickles. He might... Yes, he definitely has vampire teeth. <laughs> I feel like I need to take them out of my game. Because all of my sims, like NPCs, have... Um, let's bake another thing have vampire teeth so <laughs> i might have to get rid of those let's do um have we done lemon meringue maybe but we're doing it again if we have okay can you clean out the fridge please sorry now you can go ahead and do it <laughs> I will be fixing his outfit, don't worry. It's not pink enough, so we'll be fixing that. And actually, let me see if I can take... Yeah, I no longer have the mod or it's not working where kids can take care of um, dogs. So I'll try to see if I can do that another time but instead maybe you can where did we i found it once before maybe kids kids can't get um oh maybe kids actually can't get pen pals that's unfortunate if that's true you go pee, and then after that, get some food. That's good. 
and you are gonna go to work and you how is your skill doing oh we're almost at it okay one i think one more thing let's do what have we not done we've done these fruit cake rainbow gelatin cake bread pudding banana bread banana cream pie fudge bars exotic fruit pie shepherd's pie potato bread potato bread it doesn't look like that but let's do it i didn't know we have potato bread in the game that's good and i think this will be the last one i'm pretty sure unless we have to do it again this or the next is the is the final one and then we get to give these guys she aged up with a really pretty hair and i i'm pretty sure i can get this in pink so i think i'm just gonna keep her hair like that mm, but i'm definitely gonna change their clothes because they well she has pink slippers but <laughs> everything else is not very pink Closing the baking with the food that you eat right now in the human world. Amazing. <laughs> yeah, that was a really good uh, coincidence. Did you not go to work? Oh, eight minutes. Okay, great. Mm. What is your preferred mood? I can't see. Okay, well, just, just go to work. Yes! Woo! Reach level 10 of baking. Can I? Yes. Let's call to meal. Everyone pick up a serving of little potato bread. Oh, nobody came. <laughs> um, oh, no. He's here. He's taking a little bread. And this is the final thing. That we needed to do for little um, Alani. This is all we needed to do. And now... Oh my god, why can't you stay put? Okay, fine. Um, let's not then look at her. Oh, of course, now you've gone to nap. <laughs> this was the final thing we needed to do for Alani. Now we have done everything. And to prove that, let's go through what we needed to do. We needed to be an evil, self-assured glutton, which we obviously are. We are not. You are. Mm. Of course, we have other traits as well because of the self-discovery. And we were a public enemy that we have completed. And then we were a criminal, uh, but we have, like, we reached level 10, but we have gotten demoted because I haven't gone to work. So don't worry about that. Mm. We have mastered baking and charisma skills. Yes. Mm. Master criminal career, and uh, we did that. We lived in a TLC apartment for all of their young adult lives until she had the, the kids and had to move and uh, hide into the countryside. And then when she turned into an adult, we moved in here. So we've done that as well. We have only had these two twins. And we have insisted on being a criminal mastermind, even though we are not good at it. So, yet again, another generation is finished, and now we can go ahead. Where are you? We can go ahead and give these guys a makeover. Wow, congrats for finishing the orange gen. Thank you, already on young adult life. Well, we are an adult, don't worry. She is an adult. Mm. And we're starting these these guys' generation a little bit early. Usually I start 
the next generation either. Oh, I keep forgetting that I have this um, cast background. I have meaning to change it like a million times, but I keep forgetting. So just ignore it. Mm. What I was going to say... I forgot what I was going to say. Um, let me pull a picture of the twins for us. Mm. Where are they? Let me see screenshots. The pictures load a little slowly, so I need to go through them a little slow. Um, yeah, so now we need to um, focus on the next generation. Did I read the rules or did I not? I don't think I did. <clears throat> so we need to be neat and fluffy creative. We are going to be a best-selling author. We're going to be on the in the business career until we're an adult and then we finally decide to start writing books we need to complete postcard collection that's why i wanted the pen pal but for some reason i can't find it i need to see if i can't have a pen pal as a kid that would be really annoying but doesn't really like surprise me because kids can barely do anything in the game Mm. We need to master writing and wellness skills. So I need to get them a meditation. Like a meditation block or whatever it's called. And then have a well-maintained garden. I think not as a kid. But I'm gonna make them have a garden once they get into teens or young adulthood. We'll see. And then quit day job as an adult to pursue dreams, midlife crisis. If I can trigger a midlife crisis, I will. However, it's not going to be easy with that because I can't affect the way the midlife crisis works. So we might end up with something completely different. And we need the uh, uh, writing we need to be a a writer, want to be a writer. So I need to, to see how I'm going to do the that one, that part. Why can I not find any pictures of my kids? I'm, I swear I had pictures of them. But I just can't find them. This is really unfortunate. Because I can't... Make them look like... Um, like themselves. Hmm. Well, that's really unfortunate. I can't really become a picture though, so... <laughs> That's uh, not much I can do. We do have a picture of Veronica. So I am gonna look at that one for Ronnie. Uh, but not for Flynn, unfortunately. So she had a couple of freckles on her nose like that. I don't remember if you had freckles though. I'm gonna do her first. Mm. Oh, wow. Okay, she has a very, very interesting chin. I was a little bit worried about their appearance because um, I changed the facial features of their dads um, with uh, custom sliders in my game. Um, I'm not going to touch her face right now. But if she ends up, ends up as an adult having a really weird looking chin. Like I don't think you can have a chin like this. Like maybe, but I'm not convinced. 
So, if she ends up looking like this in the future, I wanna, I do wanna change it. But so far, I'm just gonna let it be, because it's not so important. And then, I don't know what skin details I had on her, which is unfortunate. Mm. I mean, I did have some freckles, but this is a bit much. This is kind of cute. I think I'm going to give her this one. And then some... Oh, well, wow, not those. Some lashes, and then I think she had these freckles, or maybe which freckles did you have? Oh, I think she had these ones. Let me see if she has a little. No, she doesn't. Oh, no, you can see it there. It's fine. I didn't know it was mirrored, but it's fine. It's fine. She has a little um, freckle on top of her brow. So that's good. And I'm pretty happy with that. I still want to give her this. And then this. Okay. Okay. I'm tempted to just like fix the chin a little bit. Maybe I should just do it like. Like that. So it's so, it's not so pointy. It's just a bit weird. I can't like lie. I can't see if she got um, Alani's uh, ears, but I hope. Cause she has these like a little bit of more like pointy ears i like those mm. if she if i messed it up for her like adult form i'm gonna fix it don't worry but it was just really weird looking hi welcome back anna uh, also are hopeless romantic in the sense that you always pursue love but your unflirty trait makes you hard makes it hard to find love yes Definitely, and I'm gonna play it so that um, because of their quite traumatic history and because Alani won't say anything, she wouldn't ever talk about their father, but they're gonna figure it out one day. Like, not right now, but one day. And I think that's gonna make it so that they're gonna find it really hard to trust people. Hmm. Okay, we are probably in, yes, another outfit. I'm not going to do this mistake again. She looks really cute. I really like her. We need uh, pink eyes. Mm, I think she had my custom eyes. Pretty sure. Yeah, she had my custom eyes. Otherwise, I don't think I need this one anymore. And then for lipstick, not lipstick, but these like realistic lips that I like to use. I want to give her these. And then I think I'm going to just go ahead and quickly give her all of these in every outfit. There we go. Okay. And then eyes. Yeah. I forgot you need your eyes. I think what I'm gonna do is um, 
give them only their first outfit actually or I mean I always find it a little bit like I'm unsure if cast streams are great personally like mine because sometimes I find it hard to figure out what to talk and at this point my voice is really tired and it's kind of cracking like I'm losing my voice mm. I'm just thinking like do you guys want me to do all their outfits now or do I do them later like I do one now like their first outfit and then we do something like uh, not something sorry my brain is all over the place I give them their stuff right now and then later I will do it like on my own you don't have to like look at it and be there and I'll just show it to you next stream or do you prefer to like see it do you want me to do all of their outfits let me know this would be nice but oh no actually it does have a pink option okay let's go with that and then I could give her the same trousers or pants but I'm not sure if I want to I could also go with jeans it's a bit hard to find pink pants is it We do have these, but they're like really pink. This would be great with like pink splatters, but I don't have that. It's just so pink. I would like a more pastel pink. But, and this is peach. I can't, I need to be really, really careful with this um, generation that I don't give them peach. Because the next, I have one critique for this. Well, I have a couple critiques for the challenge, but one of them is this, um, this generation and the next one are almost identical colors. I think they should have picked... Um, colors that were a bit d more different like because there's no reason why these colors need to be on every generation like plum could be orange just as well as it's plum so I think having pink and then peach is a little bit much maybe they should have gone with um like instead another color and like switch them around like do pink and then green and then peach or something like that. Postcard wellness and writing have a garden best selling author and quit your job in adult life. The career will be business. Yes. Mm, I think it's not really look pointy if it goes afar. I love the autumn Halloweeny background. Don't forget to drink. You do you anytime you can. <laughs> Thank you. I don't have any water. That's the problem. <laughs> I need to go get some. I think I'm gonna give her white pants because I can't really find good ones. And then for your shoes. Well, it's, it's winter. So I need to give them like a bit more wintry outfits. Having pink shoes a bit is a bit much. <laughs> it is a bit weird. Although, oh wow. <laughs> the shoes are not the most compatible with this game. I could go with these. I know they're a bit peachy, but 
I don't have a better pink option, so I think I'm gonna go with that. And I'm gonna also give her some nail polish. There we go. And here we have Veronica Berry. She looks like a, such a adorable little kid. I still don't know much about them, so I don't know how to dress them. But we'll see. We'll get to know it. Go. We'll get to know them uh, at some point. Um, I think you have some kind of. I think he has a yeah streaks in her in his hair. I don't want that. Mm, I like. I think he had this one. I liked that one. And then some lashes. Yes, we have Ronnie done. I think I'm gonna keep it um, for one, um, only one, come on, <laughs> you can do it brain, one outfit. Because I'm a bit tired and I'm losing my voice, but I will. Don't worry. I will make their outfits and I will also make their them their um, rooms. I'm getting really tired, so my brain cannot give me any information anymore. <laughs> like it's. You want to say a thing? Nah, not happening. <laughs> I would like to give him some some kind of edge to his hair but the options are not great I think this is the best and if I do that I can also give him a little bit of a darker darker brow like that it's a bit funky there but it's fine and um, before we actually set on Settle on that hair. I'm gonna see if I like another hair more. Mm. As a kid, he had... I think he had this hair. I do like it very much. Hmm... But we could go with the shorter hair. Or maybe he had this hair. Hmm. Or maybe he had... <laughs> I can't remember which hair he had. Oh my god, I can't. I like this one. Mm. No. <laughs> this hair rarely suits anybody. Only a couple of sims can pull it off. Or we could go with this one. It's a little bit different. But like kind of the same vibe still. What do you guys think? I think the early one with the pink is really good. Early one. You mean the first one? Or the one that I, I said I liked? This one? one doesn't have pink unfortunately i really like this one but it's not pink enough these don't really come in on natural shades I do like this one too. Oh, 
Okay, if you meant the first one, which is this one, maybe we go with this one, which is kind of the middle ground of this and this. Okay, let's go with this one. <clears throat> and then, I don't remember if he had freckles, but now he does, because <laughs> I can't remember. And then for his eyes, I think he had the same eyes as Veronica. I'm pretty sure I just gave him the same ones. So let me quickly give these to his all, all of his outfits. Forever waiting for a lock feature in Cass where you could like decide to give one feature to all outfits <clears throat> and then the lip shade which would be your like natural he has an interesting lip shade a shade. Does this even work? I don't think this works. No. Mm. This is too pale. And these are too light. And this is too pink. But this is really dark. I don't know. Maybe that. I think that makes the most sense. Okay. I think it's the same as her, uh, his sister anyway, so. <laughs> That's kind of a no-brainer then. Okay, now you are wearing like a jumper, but maybe we can give you like a little, he's a social person, so hmm. these look so cold, I don't want you to be cold in this current weather, so I do want to give you something that is warm enough. Low jumper like this. <laughs> it's a bit much. But this could work. Or... Oh, I like this one too. I wish the tartan one would be pink. But... This is fine. I like this one. And then for your pants... I think I am also gonna... Hmm, do we want to go with like crazy pants? Otherwise I'm gonna probably go with just jeans. Or actually, these come in uh, pink. I know these are a little bit peachy more than pink. But, yeah, it's a bit, I don't want to go peach. These are fun as well. What is red in these pants? Look, it says red and yellow and orange. I wonder what that is. I don't know. Hmm. What other options did we have? These? Or these are a bit much. 
or the same as your sister's. I mean, it looks really good. Hmm. Maybe I'll give him these because I don't want him to look exactly like his sister. <laughs> I don't want the same sim. Even though they're going to be very similar. At least they're child times. Okay. These are pink for sure. Then we need pink socks. And then I'm just going to quickly check that this doesn't have any more pinky colors. No. Okay. Yeah. It's fine. So, we have Flynn. And let me see your teeth before we leave. Yes. You also have. <laughs> Let's put on. Because he did miss. Uh, uh, he did lose a tooth. I'm going to give him teeth that have one tooth missing. What's the difference with. I don't know what the difference is between those. But I'm gonna give him this one. And you, I don't see any... I didn't see any, like, in... A notification. Notifications saying you were losing any teeth. So I'm gonna give you the bunny teeth. They look so cute. Okay. I'm happy with them. Do you wanna give you... I'm a little upset that we never managed to make, uh, get her, rid of her acne. Not that it really matters, but I just think that it's not very common for somebody to have acne for their whole life. For a long period of time, yes, but I don't really see many grandmothers, like old people, with acne. I don't know, maybe it is a thing. But I don't really see it that often. So I'm sometimes a little bit annoyed. Okay, not that much. That um, we can't really get rid of her acne. But at this point, it's just who she is. So it's fine. Gonna see if I can add some subtle. Because usually these don't really work. Yeah, only this works with the forehead one, but it's almost like nothing, so I'm not gonna do that. What about this layer? Nope. No, I don't like that. Lower eyelids, no. Eye bags. Okay, these show a little bit. Okay, this shows a little bit. Maybe not that much, but like here. So, she's a little bit older. She is a, uh, a, a an adult, not a young adult anymore. So I'm also going to give her new pants. That need to also be orange. Do you want to give her a dress? No. I don't think she'd be the dress life. Not really her... Mm. Everything's always yellow. It's really hard to find orange. So many things are in yellow, but not in orange. Wow. Well, <laughs> they are orange now, but that's a little bit much. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can do that. I don't really see her. Okay. I think I like this one. I don't really see her as a very dressy person. 
and then this one this is fine this one is fine this one is fine I like this a lot okay otherwise all her outfits are really nice I like them and then you oh wow you're you're building some muscle that's nice mmm I don't mind your outfits. That's fine. Okay. Wow, okay. This was the final stream where we play as Alani. Obviously, we're not going to move these kids on their own. They're going to still live in the house, so don't you worry. We'll see plenty of Alani still. What did she not like? I didn't catch that. But we're definitely now gonna start playing more as the kids. Who are you? I don't know who you are. Okay. Um, and I'm I'm gonna also give them proper outfits. Don't worry. I'm gonna go ahead and right now after I finish the stream. I'm gonna make it so that they have actual beds. Well, they do have beds, but they have like their... Um, everything set up for next stream. Clothes and rooms and everything like that. But yeah, this was really, really good that we got to end Alani's generation and now get to start playing as Flynn and Ronnie. I'm just gonna call her Ronnie. I like that nickname. Um, and we're gonna get to know them better and see what they like, what they're gonna be like. And yeah, it's gonna really, it's gonna be really fun and interesting. I'm excited. And yeah, as you said, it's gonna be a um, a generation that is closest to me or my experience in life. So it's gonna be fun to kind of play myself in the game a little bit in many ways. But I'm gonna end the, the stream right here. And thank you so much for watching. Thank you everyone who... Everyone... Blah, blah, blah. Thank you to everyone who tuned in. And I'm really excited to continue this. Next stream will be the first episode on the pink generation. And I, I'm, I'm just really excited. Of course, you can channel yourself, yourself in The Sims. Yes. All right. Take care. Don't forget to drink enough water and sleep and take care of yourselves. And I'll see you in the next one uh, a new also an extra video will be coming out on tuesday next week so um you'll have an extra video for that week as well have a good rest of the day thank you all right now i will leave you guys although i do need to see the stream for me to be able to end it